he's like, do you know why else we shear the sheep? And I, I'm, I'm like, because it's almost, because it's almost summer. And he's like, yes. And then he's like, uh, you, since you answered the question, you can come up here and shear sheep. And I'm like. It's been really awesome, first of all, because I got to shear sheep, which I was pretty excited about. It's a little bit scary at first, because you're like, am I going to cut the sheep? Uh, but then you're like, and you're like, this is cool. And especially when you get to fold back um, the wool, uh, it actually feels really soft, kind of. Well, I didn't know sheep's wool could be used for like clothes like that. It's just... It's actually kind of weird that wool can be used for pretty much anything. Uh, and, I, and I didn't know that wool was actually used in carpets. Everybody, everybody give a round of applause. I love animals. I'm an animal lover. My friend's like, did you get any wool for me? And I'm like, sorry, no, no. I'm not taking wool from a shoe. Sorry, good no. My name is Tracy Lane, and I'm an extension educator with the OSU Extension Center here in Tulsa County. And this is Kids and Cows and More. Kids and Cows and More is an educational field trip for third and fourth grade students in the Tulsa area to come to the fairgrounds in this lovely barn and to learn all about agriculture and how it affects their life on a daily basis. We bring in the students, they're here for about two and a half hours with us, and they get to learn a lot about different varieties of agriculture. Particularly, we have a lot of animals here today. They're getting to see sheep being sheared. They're seeing a horse riding demonstration. They're also learning about farm animals, about pigs and beef cattle, chickens and uh, goats as well. They're also learning about soybeans and agricultural crops and the importance of those as food for people as well as for animals. And then they also get to have a snack that comes from obviously agriculture. They're getting to try some uh, cheese and whole wheat crackers with milk, of course. Really the overall purpose is to get kids engaged at least on a brief basis with agriculture. I mean they really are, sometimes they just don't realize that they uh, are affected by agriculture every day. If they wear clothing and if they eat food then they are impacted by agriculture and most students and families are so far removed from the farm anymore, they don't have relatives that live on a farm and they just often don't realize that the milk comes from a cow not just from the grocery store.